Smart Contractor Purchase Orders Smart Contractor allows you to generate and issue purchase orders for materials and subcontracts. To create purchase orders, go to Create Purchase Orders in the Purchase menu. Click Add New to add new purchase order. The program lists all the items in the job to purchase. All the information for purchase orders is already in the job estimate, so there's no additional data entry. All you have to do is select the items you want to purchase and who you want to purchase them from. You can go through the list and select items to purchase, or you can select them by a variety of selection criteria. The prompt for project allows you to select items in all the jobs associated with the project. A project is a group of jobs. The prompt for job allows you to select any number of jobs for which to list items. The order date range allows you to specify a range of dates in which items must be ordered to be received in time for scheduled installation. Smart Contractor calculates the order date based on the scheduled installation and the purchase lead time that you specify in the Edit Estimate form. You can select items to purchase by item group, job phase, or vendor. If you assigned vendors to items in the Edit Job Estimate form, the vendors will appear here. Otherwise, you can assign or change the vendors here. The Purchase Order Item Grid displays the item's estimated count and cost. The Purchase Order Amount defaults to the estimated amount, but you can override that here. If you override the estimated count or cost, you can automatically create a change order for the additional cost here. The Purchase Order Item Grid shows the amount previously ordered and the balance to be purchased. This allows you to easily track your purchases for each job item. There is also a checkbox that allows you to indicate whether you intend to purchase more of the item. Job items will continue to appear in the Purchase Order Item list until you check this box to indicate that you are done purchasing the item. Note that items that already have a vendor assigned are automatically selected. So if you assign vendors to items in the Job Estimate Entry form, all you need to do is click OK, and the program will automatically generate all of the purchase orders for all of the vendors assigned to the items in the job. Once you have created purchase orders, you can view them or print them. Notice that you can print purchase orders in either a predefined format that comes with a smart contractor or in your own customized purchase order format. When you generate purchase orders, you can either print them or you can email them directly to your vendors or subcontractors. Emailed purchase orders are attached to email messages as PDF files. Some types of construction work cannot begin until all materials for a job or job phase have been received. Once you have created purchase orders, Smart Contractor allows you to track receipts of the materials ordered. To track purchase order receipts, go to Receive Purchase Orders in the Purchase menu and select the Purchase Order. The program will list the items in the purchase order. You can check the Received box to indicate that the item has been received, or if you have received less than the amount ordered, you can enter that here. As you enter purchase order receipts, you can track the status of purchase orders in the Purchase Order Status Report. The Purchase Order Receipt Status Report shows the amount received and the status of all purchase orders. When you receive bills for your purchases from vendors and subcontractors, you will need to pay them. Please see the video on how to enter purchases for information on how to enter your bills and track your job costs. This concludes the tutorial video on Smart Contractor customer documents. Thank you for watching.